Hey everyone, welcome to today's day trading recap for Friday, November 19th. Uh, we did our navigation trend trading uh, exclusively today. And so here's here are my day trades. Um, in 6B, the British pound, uh, a lot of these are futures, just did one stock with options. Uh, 6B plus 175, NASDAQ minus 585, QG, which is the micro natty gas. Uh, 61250, uh, Russell minus 380, had a big trade in silver for plus 2025. Uh, then the micro silver plus 65, corn basically a scratch plus 25, and the DK and G plus 272. So total for the day, 98450. Uh, let me show you what we did. So, uh, let's start with, let's start with DK and G. Um, we had, uh, we have this multi time frame indicator down here below. So this is showing the color of the trend candles on the 15, 30, 60, and 240 minute chart. And then of course we're trading off the five minute like we always do with day trading. Uh, had price come down here, it flipped over on the 15 minute. We got long right here, caught this big move up. I was out of 99% of my trade here, held onto one contract, kind of came down. I got out of my last one uh, when the candle turned red there. So nice trade in DKNG, which is some really small size. Uh, over to the futures uh, with 6B, caught a nice move in 6B. Uh, it was this one here. So when it dipped down, uh, we got long right here and caught that move up there. I just, and I, at the high of day, uh, I got out. I just did a couple contracts there. So got out there for a nice profit. Uh, NQ, the NASDAQ. Um, let's see, what did we do in the NASDAQ? I think it was... Actually, don't remember. It was a loser. Uh, sorry, usually remember these. Uh, QG. So in Natty Gas, I uh, took a short here. We started getting some uh, the higher time frames flipping over to red uh, when it bounced up here. Got short, looking for a rollover, and it pushed up. So just cut out once we got a green candle. Uh, so small loser there. Uh, let me show you silver. I'm not going to go through all these, but um, did these in the live stream. Uh, silver, this one I actually got in right before uh, we started streaming um, at about 8.15. So price came down here, flipped to an uptrend, started to turn green. So it got long right here. Actually, I got long down here, intraday, interbar. The price was a little bit lower. Caught this entire move up, held on to one contract, and came down, turned red, got out right there. So nice, uh, over $2,000 on that trade. Of course, those were the big contracts, so it's all relative. Uh, Corn, I'll show you. Uh, corn had a little scratch trade um, in corn. Uh, it was uh, really strong all morning. Pulled back into the trend candles, flipped over to the green on the 15 minute. Uh, so I got in, literally, I got in right here and uh, it bounced, uh, but the candle turned red, so I got out. So booked a little profit, even though it wasn't really a very good trade. Uh, as far as didn't continue in my direction. Um, so that's it. Uh, nice day, $984.50. What we're going to be doing is next week, we are only streaming Monday and Tuesday, offline Wednesday, Thursday, Friday for the holiday weekend. And um, so what we're going to do is for the first hour, we'll trade our traditional Mighty 90 and runner strategies, and then we'll flip over to the NTT and take a couple of these because uh, I really like getting in these after the markets kind of settle down for the first hour. And our other strategies like the Mighty 90 uh, really is beneficial from the two-sided price swing. So it works out perfect. We'll do those uh, the first hour and then we'll jump into a couple of these the second hour. So that's the plan on Monday and Tuesday. Look forward to seeing you in the live stream room. Talk to you then.